hey y'all what's up welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is adrian if you're new and if you're not new welcome back to another mother again vlog nobody move there's blood on the floor I love you. Love you <laughs> All right, y'all. So, good morning. I gotta take my nose ring out. I forgot to do that. Oh, Jesus! Oh, that went in perfectly. Wait, I don't know where to hold it. Okay, okay. All right. Oh, I don't want to listen to my music. I'm yet. not trying to let you listen to my music. There you go. Now. Still listen to your music. Here you go, navigation. I mean, the car play right here. Man, come on. <laughs> come on don't, don't be rude. You don't have none of that stuff in there. Don't so. be rude. You don't have none of that stuff in there. We're not dealing with this. I don't need you to touch. We're not dealing with this. I don't need you to touch. You'll be, you'll be having some surgery before we make it there. We paying me? Please get this man. Hey y'all, what's up? Good morning. Today is surgery day, and we are headed to the facility right now. Might be a surgery, right? Okay. My father is having um, some mixed feelings right now, mixed emotions. Why are you like this? I'm just trying to tell the girls what's going on. Anyway, so y'all saw me this morning. I woke up. Um, at like 7 30 took shower and everything well while I was getting my bed ready they called me and told me they had rescheduled my appointment so it's no longer at 11 it's now at 10 30 and we are 15 minutes away from the facility so yeah we're headed there kind of having some uh I don't know if it's I'm not nervous yet I don't know if that's it but maybe I'll be when I get in the hospital well, I guess I'll just try to get there. I guess I'll just see y'all when we get there. I'm alive. I'm dead. I met you better on the first day. I should have said it was wrong in the first place. We done, y'all. We headed home. This pillow really helped out. I'm so happy I bought it. Hey, y'all. Oh, can't see me. The car ride home has been very smooth. I don't know if it's because I might still be a little high or what. But I think this pillow is helping out a lot. It's not even touching me. And these are some good masks. Where did they get these masks from? I look so crazy. It's cool though. Oh. I keep going in and out. I'm dozing off. Now I'm about to take my medicine with some food. My daddy, my daddy brought me to Chipotle. So he went to Chipotle, he can get my Chipotle. If you ever wonder what I get from Chipotle, I always get a quesadilla. A quesadilla with pinto beans, pico, sour cream, and salad dressing. But I don't know if I can eat all that right now. So I just got pinto beans, sour cream, and a steak quesadilla. Oh, let me put y'all down. Oh. 
this holler. <laughs> I haven't told my best friends. Oh, they're gonna be so mad at me. I gotta call them. My phone is back there. Oh no. I love you, Chai and JJ. And Tiffany. And Hannah. I'm sorry I didn't call y'all yet. I'm gonna call y'all as soon as I get home. Scouts on her. Oh, I can't do it. Scouts on her. I gotta edit the vlog. Oh, hell. Ooh. This is a good mask. I'm gonna have to keep this. Hey, you all. We here. We got a little baby boobies. You see you? I don't got no drinks. I'm happy about that. This is a good bra. Huh? Yeah. He drew all the way down to my, to my, to my, what's it called? Navel. My navel. Look, look at the setup. My little brother brought me those things. Flowers and candy. <laughs> I have very little brothers. Anyway, they said the surgery was cool. All the nurses were cool. All right, she's signing out. The night. Okay. Oh, the pain is medium. It's not. It's not hard right now, but it is not day one. Day one is tomorrow, so we'll figure it out how it goes tomorrow. Hey y'all, what's up? Good morning. Today is officially day one of recovery. It's September tenth, and it's uh, eight fifty-eight a.m. Um, I haven't pooped yet. So I just took some stool softeners. Um, I've been taking my medicine. The medicine definitely has me going in and out. I'm like, get them up, get them, get them up. <laughs> but my spirits are high. Um, I've been shopping. I've been shopping. I told y'all the fashion hauls will come back soon, but just not until after this was done. So you can see, can y'all see my lip? Right here. I think when they were putting the tube down my throat, I think they made me bite my own lip. I think that's what happened. Or whenever it was, they were taking it out. I might have clenched down on my lip or something. But my lips weren't dry. <laughs> shout out to the EOS chapstick. Y'all know I love me some chapstick. So shout out to EOS. Yeah, so now I'm just chilling here. I'm about to start editing the weekly vlog. That will go up tomorrow, but I feel good. I feel great, actually. My my skin is pretty good. But now y'all can see how off my nose rings are. And it's really upsetting me and my homegirls. Like, I really need to go get this one repierced because why is it down here? It's supposed to be up here. Y'all, I look taller. Like, I look like I have a torso now, and it's so weird. It's so weird. Like, I look taller and smaller. <sighs> they took 10 pounds away from me. 10 pounds. But, yeah. So, I'm just about to... I'm about to do a little bit more shopping. And then, I'm going to go ahead and start editing. Because I ain't doing nothing else. <laughs> I got to stay in bed. <laughs> I forgot to tell y'all about my pain and everything. So, right now, my pain is like... It's like a 4 or 5. He gave me some pain blockers, so maybe that's what's helping me. But he also uh, put like something in my incisions to help with the pain. So it's not it's not really bad. It just feels like I was working out really hard with my chest, like focusing on bench press and stuff. So that's what it feels like right now. But it also feels like I'm kind of like like cause they're right here. My neck is right here. <laughs> So it kind of feels like I'm suffocating. But I'm not. I just have all this dressing right here. And I have uh, two heating pads right now that my mom uh, heated up for me. I think they're kind of cool enough for me to take them out the, yeah, out the towel. But this is what they look like. They fit literally everywhere. I love these things. So literally anesthesia so wild like she was like you're gonna go to sleep now and I was like oh, okay and the next thing I was asleep 
And then I woke up in the recovery room. So I'm like, I didn't even know how long I was out, but basically, um, so. I'm excited. Hey y'all, so I don't know. I know a lot of people have like weird, <clears throat> weird reactions. Excuse my voice. I think it's from like the tube that they put down my throat for the anesthesia or whatever. But I think I'm having a weird reaction to the anesthesia because I can't eat nothing. Like everything I eat is either too salty or it's too sweet. And I'm like, damn, where is this coming from? Because this was not happening before, you know what I'm saying? Like, my mommy got me these pure leaf sweet teas. This is the extra sweet kind. And typically, I like these. But I've had this tea since last night. And I've only drank it when I wanted to drink, I mean, uh, take my medicine. And then I got some liquid IV, right? And typically, liquid IV is cool. Like, I could probably, I could probably drink a whole bottle. You know what I'm saying? But this is my liquid up. Literally, it's still up here because it's just so salty, and I don't know why. Like, I don't know. Like, I've had COVID before, and it feels like, like I could still. I, I don't have COVID right now. Like, I'm not sick. But when you lose your taste or your sense of smell or whatever, it like changes your taste buds so everything when i when i was sick everything was so salty or too sweet like you know what i'm saying well nothing was too sweet but everything was very salty so i i literally all i ate today was a protein shake a half of a protein shake yeah and water i still haven't pooped tmi um but yeah i still haven't went to the restroom for number two and I've been taking, um, what's the, the bowel movement pills or whatever. I've been taking those, but nothing happened yet. So we just waiting on that. Um, I'm sitting here shopping. I told y'all we were going to get back into the fits in a little bit. And this is what I was trying to like tell y'all about. I was trying to warn y'all, but like not warn y'all, if that makes sense. So I was just saying like, yeah, we're just waiting to go shopping and stuff, but in reality, y'all, this is my nose ring. <laughs> but in reality, your girl was, yeah, planning this the whole time. So also, um, if you have nose piercings and stuff, definitely check out these plastic nose rings. I'll leave them linked down below for y'all. But yeah, so I'm just over here shopping because I want to re I, I want to redo my entire closet, which is why I got rid of all my clothes. So yeah. Um, right now I'm on Shein. We're gonna see how that goes. Y'all already know. I'm so hungry. Like, and then it's crazy because I'm not hungry. Like, my body isn't hungry. But I just know I'm hungry. I know I'm supposed to eat. It's like 2.39 right now. And literally I had a bite of a, my daddy tried to make me a um, bacon and egg sandwich. Too salty. Everything was so salty. Even the bread was salty. And then, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I've tried to eat today. So, <sighs> I gotta buy something to eat. Hey y'all, what's up? Today is Sunday, September 11th. I just finished editing the weekly vlog. This vlog has been so hard for me to edit because I keep going in and out of sleep. But, it got done, so that's all that matters. Um... I still haven't used the restroom yet and I've literally taken Dulcolax and Miralax all day. Still no movement so I'm kind of concerned about that but I just ate some ice cream so hopefully that go on in there and break it down but um yeah I just been kind of in this spot all day so I've been doing a lot of shopping so I got a hat already this is I got a trucker hat and this looks like the rest of my package but I'm not going to be able to try that on right now what are those cargos Pots. yeah he can leave them in the bag so I got some cargos 
Y'all, I'm so excited. I get to wear things now. And shirt. Yeah, that's a shirt. Put it right there. With you. Actually, hold them two up together. Let me see. Also, this little pillow right here with the pockets in the front has been such a lifesaver. Oh, yeah, I could do that. Yeah. But yeah, so today um, I actually want to take a shower. My doctor told me I could take a shower yesterday, but I just didn't feel comfortable. Like, with it just being day one and me already getting in water. So, my mom is going to, like, bathe me down. I hate this. I hate this. I hate this. I'm going to get to change. Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm going to get to change out of these pajamas because... Uh, I smell like blood and I hate it. Like, I just feel. So, yeah, I want to change all my pajamas. I don't know what color I'm going to put on next, though. I think I'm going to do black or gray. <laughs> How's my patient? We're doing well. We yeah. had ice cream. How am I going to go potty? <laughs> I don't have to go potty right now. <laughs> Can I wait? It's been like four hours already. Four hours for what? It's only been two, Mom. I don't think y'all gave me enough. It's starting to come alive. Hmm? It's starting to come alive. What's starting to come alive? You heard it? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm talking about using the restroom. I don't think y'all gave me enough Miralax. You don't have enough water in your system. I've been drinking so much water. Then she had a little dessert break. Exactly, I had ice cream. I don't know what happened to this break. They're all supposed to be breaking up, but whatever. But yeah, so I don't know if I told y'all, but I haven't really been able to eat anything. Like, I don't really eat whole plates or anything like that. So like, I had half of a breakfast taco this morning. And then my daddy gave me like a couple little strips of steak, like maybe five pieces of steak. I was able to eat those, but I wasn't able to eat the whole breakfast taco. And my doctor told me that basically I needed to get a whole lot of protein in while um, I'm recovering. So I've just been like drinking protein shakes and eating steak basically. But I haven't really been hungry, so I don't know. I don't know, girl. I don't know what the deal is, but yeah. I'm just kind of ready for all this to be. My first checkup appointment is on the 15th, so I'm excited about that. Hopefully, he, you know, takes me out of my bandages and everything, but we'll see. So, yeah, I just wanted to come and update y'all, let y'all know how I was doing, and I'll talk to y'all later. Hey, y'all, what's up? Good morning. Today is, let me see. Today is Monday, September 12th. I think today is officially day three of recovery. I'm feeling a whole lot better and I'm moving a lot faster. But I just feel so dirty. I just feel so dirty. I want to take a bath so bad. Like yesterday, I was supposed to take a bath. Like my mom was supposed to help me wipe down. But then they gave me the medicine and I went to sleep. And then everybody had to go to work in the morning. So I wasn't able to take a bath. So I'ma definitely try to get my ass clean. Cause I stink and I don't like this. I wasn't built like this. Okay. Anyway, I hope y'all are enjoying the weekly vlog that I put out yesterday. It was so hard for me to edit that vlog, y'all, because I kept going in and out. I'm like so I'm watching it back right now to make sure like that it's a, a good a good vlog or whatever the swelling in my chest has gone down a little bit not a whole lot y'all can't even see it I'm gonna show y'all in the morning when I actually get up I don't know y'all <sighs> everything just feels so tight like it just feels so tight but I haven't shown y'all I don't think I showed y'all what I look like I don't think I showed y'all what I look like in the mirror yet, but they're so small. I'm kind of nervous. Like, what if I look unproportionate now? 
and also it's hard for me to like straighten my back i can't straighten my back like if i feel like if i try to straighten my back i'm gonna pop something so i'll be walking over like hunched i'll be walking hunched over and i don't like that also i've been in this bed so fucking long i feel like my booty getting flat i can't have no titties and a flat booty i can't even do a squat right now though after after all this recovery and shit, we're going to the gym okay because i cannot right now the best purchases that i have made for this surgery has been this little seating thing this little wedge set that i purchased on amazon this little can y'all oh, hold on i can't even see the little white thing right there it's a shower caddy it holds everything that i like need to reach for so it has like my wallet my little lacrosse balls so i can massage my chest my candy my bonnet so that's a great purchase and then this here freaking mastectomy pillow i don't go nowhere without it i got my remote to my tv in here i got my remote to my fan and my light in here and i'll be putting my phone in there so i don't have to like I gotta reach for nothing everything is right here um i also like my pregnancy pillow but it's really heavy and it's hard for me to put it like i really hate this <sighs> it's hard for me to put my my pillow on by myself because it's a little heavy so um yeah but i'm just ready to be a baddie again that's all i want i'm tired looking like this i'm tired of smelling like this I just want to be a baddie. That's it. <laughs> Lord, don't let my titties be too small. <laughs> I'm really swollen. Like, this is nothing but swelling. It's crazy. I got tired of sitting in my bed, so we set up shop on the couch for a little bit. Hey, y'all. Update. So, I just took my first little wipe off slash shower, whatever you want to call it um like a bird bath and i feel so much better like uh, i feel so much better i'm so happy like that i got to take a shower i see my boobies and they're so small it's so crazy um my hair did not stay braided so hopefully my mom will braid it up again but i'm just so ready to be cute that's all i want i want this swelling to go down and i want to be cute it's like my shoulders are so tense like they're just up here my shoulders are up here when they're supposed to be down here you know i'm just ready for all this swelling to go down so that my shoulders can go down so i can sit up straight i can't sit up straight right now there's so much going on but yeah so i just want to update y'all let y'all know that i took my first little wipe off bird bath still no luck in the stool department but hopefully some come soon. I just drank some Smooth Move. And y'all already know how Smooth Move be doing you. It, 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 it gets you right. Yeah. I also changed out my surgery bra. I put on one of the ones from Amazon that I showed y'all. And although it's tighter, it's a lot softer. So I feel better like in it. So yeah. So now I'm just sitting here bored. I'm finna turn on some vlogs. Maybe catch up with the girls on YouTube because I don't got nothing else to do. I really want a, 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 I really want a crumble cookie. I really, really, really want it. I really want a crumble cookie. I want the banana cream pie one. So I'm gonna see if like my daddy will go get it or if somebody can go get it for me. <laughs> but nobody wants me to leave the house. And I'm like, I just wanna walk around, but I can't really walk around, so. Swollen. I am so bloated by the way like I don't even know if I showed y'all but I am so bloated it's ridiculous I hate it here look y'all my dad made me a sandwich it looks so good this is so fancy Cause I'm very loud
Hey y'all, what's up? Today is Thursday. Let me see what time it is. Today's Thursday is 3.50 p.m. Um, I think today is like day five of recovery. And so, five or six, which one? Either way, today is day five or six of recovery. And I just poopy TMI, but I did just use the restroom for the second time today. Um, this one was a little bit easier to get out if that's not TMI. But um, yeah, I feel so much better now that I know my system is kind of flowing still. Um, my appetite has come back very much strong. <laughs> So I am able to eat more. But girl, I feel like Will Tame off of Monsters Inc. The lady that was like, Mike Mazowski. Hello, Wazowski. Fun filled evening plan for tonight. I feel like I look like her. Like I feel so ugly right now. <sighs> I'm just ready for this to be over. I'm so ready for it to be over. I just want to be back to normal. Well, not normal, but I want to be back to being cute, being fly, posting, you know. Because, girl, let me tell you something. It's starting to, like, tingle or itch or something. You know, where my mom at? Oh, she's supposed to be in here helping me with my medications. But anyway, so, yeah, I just wanted to update y'all and let y'all know that I finally made a booby. I'm gonna change out of these pajamas and change out my dressing and everything um, today. So I'm excited about that. I'm trying to figure out what color I'm gonna wear next. But yeah, I just, I feel so disgusting. Like I feel so ill. Like, I don't know how else to explain it. I just feel so disgusting. <sighs> my hair look a mess. I look a mess. Like, this is just a mess. So today was my one week checkup appointment. Um, I just got back from the doctor's office. And girl, he said everything looks great. I'm still so swollen, but um, he said within these next couple weeks, everything should come down. I just got my Shein haul in. So spoiler alert, y'all are going to be getting another Shein haul, girl. I haven't done a Shein haul in so long and I'm so nervous about it, but whatever. He said everything looked great. They tested my tissue to make sure there was no type of anything hiding, like no type of disease or anything hiding in my breast tissue. So that's a great great thing i'm so grateful for that um but yeah i just i'm ready to be able to lift and and reach again like i can this is probably the most movement that i can do as far as lifting and reaching but um yeah he was like i should stop my narcotics today so i'm done with my nar well almost done with my narcotics um I took a shower and everything today. Y'all, every time I take a bath, I feel so much better. Like, I'll be miserable. I think that's the most miserable part of this journey is not being able to take a bath for me. Um, luckily, I didn't really have um, the pain that a lot of other people were experiencing. He did inject my breast with some type of nerve blocker or something like that. And he gave me a nerve blocker pill and my narcotics. So, like, I haven't really experienced true true pain i think the most pain that i've experienced were around my incisions and um like just the the tightness in my chest um so i'm grateful for that everything has been going so smooth <sighs> yeah so today i'm announcing um i'm announcing that i'm getting surgery in my life update so if y'all haven't seen that definitely make sure y'all go and check that video out but yeah, as far as anything else, I am chilling, girl. I've been in this bed. I kind of walked around a little bit, walked around the house. I'm moving a lot faster now. I'm just ready for my shoulders to finally drop, okay? Because they are so 
tense right now. Like I need a full body massage, okay? And a chiropractor because my back up here, like in the middle of like my chest area, but in my back, girl. My doctor said everything's running smoothly. Everything looks great. So I'm excited. I'm just ready for these to finally drop because right now, look at this. Like it's so insane how small they are. Oh, they're like little baby rocks. Like ugh, I'm just tired of the tightness. So yeah, but all in all, I'm excited. I just got my clothes in like I told y'all and I'm nervous like. The clothes look a little too big and I'm so scared, I'm so scared. The, at first my problem was that like my boobs were too big so now that I don't have any or they're very small, now I have to worry about like things actually fitting. So it's like I'm learning to dress myself all over again and this is gonna be such a journey so make sure y'all stick around for all the hauls and all the fashion content that is going to be coming towards you. Y'all have been killing my DMs, killing the comments, asking me to put out more fashion content because, you know, y'all like it or whatever. So make sure y'all go and like these videos and watch them. Okay. But yeah, other than that, today I'm just chilling. I really, 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 really want crumble. I really want crumble. Like, I need it at this point, okay? I just have to come in and check in with y'all. I love y'all so much. Also, I've been keeping in my plastic nose rings because they don't irritate me at all. And yeah, I'm just, I just don't want anything to irritate me right now. So yeah, as you can see, I'm in a great mood. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead, edit this life update, and then I'll hit you guys later. Yes! Why they why they do that little bit like that? Let's see which one you want to try, Bryce. Okay, me and me and Papa Love. Oh, I'm sorry. Me and Bryce are gonna try the what is this called? Banana pudding. Banana cream pie. Banana cream pie. Okay. Did how do you even they did this wrong? Everybody else stuff be separated. I'm scared. Okay. Are you scared? This is not no um. Okay. It is banana pudding, but you said what? Banana cream pot? That that's that is smell like it just okay. smells like pure banana pudding. Okay, okay. Three, two, one. <laughs> Y'all weird. It's busting. It's like a regular sugar cookie. I had better. <laughs> it's like a regular sugar cookie with like banana stuff on top. I like sugar cookies. Mm. No? Okay. Okay. It's good to me. Rated out of 10. 7.5. 7.5? Mm. Cause it's just, it's just a normal sugar cookie. I can see that. I can see that. Okay, I, can, I respect that. Alright, now we got the moon, moon cake. Moon pie. <laughs> Alright, no, I'm going with that one. Hmm? Moon pie cookie. Moon pie cookie. You already know. I destroy moon pies. You like moon pies? I love moon pies. I thought you were too young Especially today. the um chocolate one. I can destroy these right here. Three, two, one. I'm disappointed. Okay, when you get a little bit of the cream in there, it's good. I'm it's okay. Sugar, sugar, sugar. It's okay. They hyped it up on t uh, TikTok. Didn't they? We should have tried the two, like two, three weeks ago mm. ones. Because those are actually the good ones. How you know? You didn't have it. I know, because they, they, actually, they actually look good. Yeah. They're just typing these up too much. It's a box of sugar cookies. Mm -hmm. Maybe next week, Mom. They'll probably have better. Well, you going to do a TikTok with me? Thanks, Mom. They were good, though. Girls, we've had a breakthrough. I repeat, we have had a breakthrough the eagle has landed i just took my first big poopy tmi but i'm happy i feel so freaking relieved y'all i have been struggling str 
struggling for a week. My stomach has been so bloated. And now I feel like I can get back to a normal schedule. Oh, I'm so excited. We're being watched by the Paw Patrol. It's my 13 year old little brother. 14. You're not 14. I'm six months away from you. Get out of my room. There's a very strict code in the Paw Patrol house, obviously. That's what you get, uh huh. That's what you get. That's what <laughs> you get. Don't be laughing in there. That's, that's what you get. Always trying to be something. Take my hat off. Always trying to be something. Get out. Always trying to do something to make you look cool. Which which Paw Patrol uh, Ranger are you? Don't worry about it. Are you the fire truck or are you the policeman? I think you're the policeman because you act like 12. 13. And that joke was not even funny. Yeah, nobody even likes you. How about that? You had your you 10 had minutes. Your, you had to take your other medicine today. No, I don't have to take my other medicine today. It's been four hours. It's been more than four hours. Yeah, so you have to take your medicine. Leave me alone. Oh, and another one. Oh, and another one. Well, she tried to be cool and not lean her head back and just stuff him into her mouth. That's a shirt with it. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I am back in the bed. I tried to get out of the bed, you know, every once in a while so that, like, I can get used to moving around. What do you want? I'm sure, I'm sure. Hmm. We about to install this ring on your bedroom, though. A ring? Mm -hmm. What does that even the mean? With the camera. <sighs> it is Fort Knox in this house right now. Today is Saturday, September 17th. And I am quite frankly O B E R I T. Okay. I want to get out. I want to be in the streets. But I cannot, y'all. The most miserable thing about this whole ensemble, this whole soiree, is, you know what, actually there's a couple of things <laughs> that is the most difficult. However, first being, I cannot shower just yet. I feel like a ball of just disgust. I want the water hitting my back. I want it to be scalding hot. Maybe not scalding, but I need nice hot water. And I need smell soap. Smell good soap. I'm tired of being an unscented human being. This is not the life I chose, okay? So that's number one. Number two, the stitches in the middle right here and on the very side are so awful. We're well, not on drugs. They're terrible. So, as you just seen, my uh, Power Ranger Paw Patrol just gave me two Tylenol because my doctor removed me from um, my narcotics. So, I'm done with the narcotics. So I just took two Tylenol and, and we just need those to kick in. We need them to kick in because I can't do this no more. Good God. The thing that I'm questioning the most right now at this point is what is going to be in next week's vlog? Are we just going to vlog from the bed? <laughs> we'll figure it out. But um, I believe this is going to be the last day of my recovery vlog. So thank you so much for watching. I hope y'all um, enjoyed. I hope you got something out of it. I'm not sure what. <laughs> but I hope you got something out of it. You know, if you're thinking about doing this, hey, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm happy with the size, truly. But I just need the recovery process. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. I'm happy with the size. But I just need the recovery process to kick in faster. Okay. So, yeah. This is day. I have no clue. Um, but 
it's the last day y'all gonna be seeing this um surgery vlog or whatever so yeah make sure y'all tune in to my weekly vlogs turn on your post notifications all that good stuff leave a comment down below and i will see y'all in my next one